Hi everybody, welcome to Simply Scuba. In today's video, we're gonna be taking a closer look at the Dive Pro CL4200B. So this is a cable light or umbilical torch, depending on what you uh, you call them, but it's basically a way of having a, a pretty powerful head that produces a lot of bright light with a sensible burn time. Because usually if you have something very, very bright, it has a very short burn time. Or if you have something with a bigger battery, then it's not quite as, uh, as bright. So this kind of covers both ends. This battery pack, rechargeable you can fit that wherever you want on your bcd onto your hip or around behind you and then you have the umbilical that leads to the head that sits on the back of your hand so you get the best of both worlds without a torch with a big bulky battery in your hand let's take a closer look so this is how it arrives uh, in a cardboard box which is quite nice um it's quite handy for me because it's got a lot of information on the front to give to you guys uh so 4200 lumens very, very bright, uh, three and a half hour battery. Uh, that's because it's got that separate canister, uh, 100 meter dive depth, it's deeper than I can go, so that's fine. Um, and then you get a few different versions of it. This is just the, uh, the standard version. Um, uh, yeah, Dive Pro website, and that's about it as far as the box goes. On the inside of the box, uh, okay, so we have, the head, which comes in this, uh, so the bubble wrap. So that's the head. Um, I'll show you all this in uh, in greater detail. Uh, I imagine that uh, an elastic band was supposed to keep that in position. Uh, it also has like a little neoprene bag um, and another bit of bubble wrap. Um, so yeah, you get this neoprene bag, which is quite nice. There's the uh, the canister. Again, I'll show you this all in, uh, in greater detail in a second, because um, you get all sorts of goodies on the inside of this bag. So this one, so that's your Goodman style handle. Uh, quick adjust, so you can adjust it for the size of your hands. Um, you also get a recharging uh, sort of point with a UK three pin plug and that, uh, and that plugs into there so you can recharge the battery. You also get a battery protective cover with a little Jubilee band so you can clamp it down. You also get another Jubilee clip, some bright pink, um, uh, like silicone loops, I imagine just to sort of personalize it so they uh, they stand out, but only bright pink apparently. Dive Pro CL4200B canister light operation manual piece of paper just with information about said torch and yeah, battery charging, usage and maintenance, just information on how to use it properly. You also get some silica gel, do not consume, um, as well as a pair of spare O-rings, uh, a couple little nuts, uh, correction bolts, and an Allen key so that you can fit it. So that will be so that you can attach it onto the, uh, the Goodman style handle, which I'll show you in a second. Uh, and that's it. The, uh, the bag itself, so it has this sort of Velcro closed uh, sort of handle up at the top. On the front, we have a mesh panel, which is zippered. So you can put stuff inside of that. A uh, decent size pouch on that. On the back, we have Dive Pro with their logo and stuff on it. Another zippered pouch on the front. Nothing inside of that. And then on the uh, in the main section, which is zipper closure, you have a mesh panel section. You have the main section itself, and then two separate sort of neoprene stitched panels. So quite a useful little uh, little bag to uh, sort of keep everything in. Uh, so I'm gonna uh, sort of fit that Goodman style handle and we can take a better look at the torch itself. Okay, so starting off with the battery, let's do the boring thing first. Uh, so the battery, uh, I've just slipped the, um, uh, the Jubilee band on it so that you can, that's what it's there for. You can attach things onto it and then you can mount that wherever you want, whether it's behind you on your side or whatever. Um, the cable on this version comes straight out and this top section unscrews. Um, now it's got lots of screw threads. This does take some time. Uh, I'm going to do my best to, uh, to fill in this time. Uh, otherwise, Sean might have to do a bit of a, uh, a time skip because uh, there's a lot of threads on this. Double O-ring seal. You can see underneath that with those two red O-rings. 
and then on the inside so this is the battery connector uh, and then you have that uh, you recharge it through that central hub on the inside these two points are, uh, are touching on these metal contacts and that's where the, uh, the power comes from if i do back up again really quickly as quick as i can <clears throat> Okay, keep going until you can't see the, uh, the O-rings anymore, and then it's just a few more rotations just to make sure it's nice and secure. The cable itself, nice and chunky, um, so pretty tough. And then onto the, uh, the actual head of it. So the head has a battery activation. I fitted it to the Goodman style handle just so that you can see. Now this section goes up and down so you can adjust for the size of the gloves that you're wearing and uh, very quick and easy just to, uh, to adjust those. You don't actually need tools. If you want to tighten it up to make sure it doesn't go anywhere, you can sort of use a coin just to tighten it up, but it's not, uh, not necessary. Single LED in this one and, uh, and very powerful sort of reflectors that focus that light. Uh, press the button. If you hold it down, that switches it on. I'll show you the beam in a second. And around that metal button, you actually see this blue color. So this is a battery level indicator so that you can see roughly how much power you have left. Turning it to face me. So this is on the uh, the low power setting. If I dial it up even more, um, then yeah, my camera is gonna get really confused, but it's a fairly, um, it's a bit of a spotlight beam. Uh, you can see it does have a corona uh, around it, so it does focus a lot of the light, but you can still see the uh, the sort of the overall scene around it as well. But very very powerful. So. Um, you do get plenty of light coming out of this and because you've got that big battery as well it means you get the burn time as well nice and light actually the uh, the heads you uh, you don't really notice it the battery does have a bit of weight to it but nowhere near the uh, the older sort of lead batteries um this one is uh, is pretty comfortable to uh, sort of hold on to and yeah the two together make a very powerful torch with a sensible burn time so that's the dive pro cl 4200b torch very, very powerful, fairly focused, uh, sort of relatively spotlight beam. It's, it's kind of a middle ground. It could be a bit tighter, but then it's a bit more like a laser. Um, but if it goes uh, sort of too much more, then it turns into a bit of a floodlight and just illuminates everything. But for me, yeah, very, very powerful, decent sized battery as well. So even if you use it on the lower power setting, you just get the longer burn time. I just weighed these two together. They weigh just over 1.3 kilos, so it's not particularly heavy. The battery pack is the uh, is the heaviest part, but actually, hey, if you need a uh, powerful torch, then yeah, this is a very smart thing. For more information, check out our website, simplyscuba.com. There's gonna be a link down in the description below so you can check it out and buy it. Thank you for watching, and of course, safe diving.